What's going on everyone? Welcome to the channel. So I figured since today is just such a beautiful day, it's not that hot, there's a slight breeze, I figured today would be a good day to give the old D here its first wash. I mean, I've had this thing, what, five years and I don't think it's ever seen a hose. It could use it. So here's how I'm gonna be taking care of this today. I've got the uh, foam cannon set up with some Adams Polishes Mega Foam. Then I'm gonna be using the Sweet Patina, uh, all-purpose cleaner on like the tires, the wheels, inside the wheel wells, things like that. Then I'm gonna finish it up with some of the Sweet Patina Patina Sauce. Let's get started. I'm not going to I'll tell you what guys, for as good as this Adams polishes mega foam smells, I mean this stuff smells like it smells like bubblegum. It's pretty damn good. It ain't got nothing on the sweet patina all-purpose cleaner. I mean this stuff, I don't even know how to explain it. This stuff just smells amazing. I mean you just gotta get some for yourself. If anything, just to huff it. I mean, this stuff smells amazing. I'm gonna use this around the uh all the door jams. Let's get to that. All right, well, with all that done, now it's time for the sweet patina, patina sauce. Uh, this stuff says to take a clean microfiber, wipe it on, and let it set for about 15, 20 minutes, and then wipe it off. All right, guys, so I've done the whole truck except for this half of the hood. And that was on purpose because I wanted you guys to be able to see the difference between the side that gets the patina sauce 
and the side that didn't. I let it sit, it's been about 20 minutes or so, buffed out the whole rest of the truck and just stuff to do that half. But I really wanted you guys to be able to see, look at the difference in that. God, it looks so much better with the patina sauce. I mean, it's, it just brings a little bit of luster back to the old paint. And I mean, this looks really good, but where it really shines is on areas where there's a little bit of surface rust and stuff like that. That's where this stuff really shines. So there you have it guys, just a, a fun little video for today. Uh, I highly recommend picking up some of that Adams Polishes Foam Cannon Soap along with the products from Sweet Patina. Now, this isn't, this isn't uh, sponsored or anything like that. I bought all the Sweet Patina stuff on my own, so I'm completely unbiased here. There's no affiliation whatsoever. Just a really good product and I highly recommend it. I uh, appreciate you guys for watching. Hit that subscribe, hit the bell, and I'll see you on the next one.